engine instrument systems. 1. Which unit most accurately indicates fuel consumption of a reciprocating engine? Fuel flow meter. 2. In an aircraft equipped with a pressure drop type fuel flow indicating system, if one of the injector nozzles becomes restricted, this would cause a decrease in fuel flow with and increased fuel flow indication on the gauge. 1. Generally, when a turbine engine indicates high EGT for a particular EPR, when there is no significant damage, it means that the engine is out of trim. 2. Some turbine-powered aircraft use RPM as the primary indicator of thrust produced, others use EPR as the primary indicator. Regarding the above statements, both number 1 and number 2 are true. 3. The fuel flow indication system used with many fuel injected opposed engine airplanes utilizes a measure of fuel pressure. 4. What basic meter is used to indicate cylinder head temperature in most aircraft? Galvanometer. 5. In a turbine engine, where is the turbine discharge pressure indicator sensor located? Immediately after the last turbine stage. 6. Jet engine thermocouples are usually constructed of CHROMELLUMEL. 7. Instruments that measure relatively high fluid pressures, such as oil pressure gauges, are usually what type? Borden tube. 8. Motor driven impeller and turbine fuel flow transmitters are designed to transmit data. Using aircraft electrical system power. 9. What unit in a tachometer system sends information to the indicator? The three phase AC generator. 10. The RPM indication of a synchronous AC motor tachometer is governed by the generator. Frequency. 11. The fuel flow indication data sent from motor driven impeller and turbine and motorless type fuel flow transmitters is a measure of fuel mass flow. 1. Power plant instrument range markings show whether the current state of power plant operation is normal, acceptable for a limited time, or unauthorized. 2. Power plant instrument range markings are based on installed engine operating limits which may not exceed, but are not necessarily equal to those limits shown on the engine type certificate data sheet. Regarding the above statements, both number 1 and number 2 are true. 12. A change in engine manifold pressure has a direct effect on the mean effective cylinder pressure. 13. On a twin engine aircraft with fuel injected reciprocating engines, one fuel flow indicator reads considerably higher than the other in all engine operating configurations. What is the probable cause of this indication? One or more fuel nozzles are clogged. 14. Engine pressure ratio is the total pressure ratio between the front of the compressor and the rear of the turbine. 15. If the thermocouple leads were inadvertently crossed at installation, what would the cylinder temperature gauge pointer indicate? Moves off scale on the zero side of the meter. 16. The EGT gauge used with reciprocating engines is primarily used to furnish temperature readings in order to obtain the best mixture setting for fuel efficiency. 17. Which statement is correct concerning a THERMOCOUPLE type temperature indicating instrument system? It requires no external power source. 18. The engine pressure ratio EPR indicator is a direct indication of engine thrust being produced. 19. The purpose of an exhaust gas analyzer is to indicate the fuel air ratio being burned in the cylinders. 20. Which of the following instrument conditions is acceptable and does not require immediate correction? Case paint chipped. 5. 21. The fuel flow indicator rotor and needle for a motor impeller and turbine indicating system is driven by an electrical signal. 22. 
Why do helicopters require a minimum of two synchronous tachometer systems? One indicates engine RPM and the other main rotor RPM. One engine pressure ratio, EPR, is a ratio of the exhaust gas pressure to the engine inlet air pressure, and indicates the thrust produced. Regarding the above statements, only number one is true. 23. In addition to fuel quantity, a computerized fuel system, CFS, with a totalizer indicator provides indication of how many of the following. 3. Fuel time remaining at current power setting. 3. 24. A complete break in the line between the manifold pressure gauge and the induction system will be indicated by the gauge registering. Prevailing atmospheric pressure. 25. Basically, the indicator of a tachometer system is responsive to change in. Frequency. 26. The fuel flow meter used with a continuous fuel injection system installed on an aircraft horizontally opposed reciprocating engines measures the fuel pressure drop across the fuel nozzles. 27. On an aircraft turbine engine, operating at a constant power, the application of engine anti-icing will result in noticeable shift in EPR. 28. Instruments that provide readings of low or negative pressure, such as manifold pressure gauges, are usually what type? Diaphragm or bellows. 29. What instrument on a gas turbine engine should be monitored to minimize the possibility of a hot start? Turbine inlet temperature. 30. An indication of unregulated power changes that result in continual drift of manifold pressure indication on a turbo supercharged aircraft engine is known as bootstrapping. 31. A manifold pressure gauge is designed to indicate absolute pressure in the intake manifold. 32. Which of the following instrument discrepancies require replacement of the instrument? 2. Glass cracked. 4. Will not zero out. 5. Pointer loose on shaft. 8. Fogged. 2, 4, 5, 8. 33. The exhaust gas temperature, EGT, indicator on the gas turbine engine provides a relative indication of the turbine inlet temperature. 34. What instrument indicates the thrust of a gas turbine engine? Engine pressure ratio indicator. 35. Engine oil temperature gauges indicate the temperature of the oil entering the engine. 36. What is the primary purpose of the tachometer on an axial compressor turbine engine? Monitor engine RPM during starting and to indicate overspeed conditions. 37. A red triangle, dot, or a diamond mark on an engine instrument face or glass indicates the maximum limit for high transients such as starting. 38. A board and tube instrument may be used to indicate 1. Pressure 2. Temperature 1 and 2. 39. In what units are turbine engine tachometers calibrated? percent of engine RPM. 40. In regard to using a turbine engine oil analysis program, which of the following is not true? Generally, an accurate trend forecast may be made after an engine's first oil sample analysis. 41. Which of the following types of electric motors are commonly used in electric tachometers? Synchronous motors. 42. The indication on a THERMOCOUPLE type cylinder head temperature indicator is produced by a current generated by the temperature difference between dissimilar metal hot and cold junctions. 43. The principal fault in the pressure type fuel flow meter indicating system installed on a horizontally opposed continuous flow fuel injected aircraft reciprocating engine is that a plugged fuel injection nozzle will cause a higher than normal fuel flow indication. 44. 
a common type of electrically operated oil temperature gauge utilizes either a Wheatstone bridge or ratio meter circuit. 45. Thermo cow upo leads are designed for a specific installation and may not be altered. 46. Where are the hot and cold junctions located in an engine cylinder temperature indicating system? The hot junction is located at the cylinder and the cold junction is located at the instrument. 47. What would be the possible cause if a gas turbine engine has high exhaust gas temperature, high fuel flow, and low RPM at all engine power settings? Turbine damage or loss of turbine efficiency. 48. Which statement is true regarding a THER MOCOUP LE type cylinder head temperature measuring system? The voltage output of a thermocouple system is determined by the temperature difference between the two ends of the thermocouple. 49. Which of the following is a primary engine instrument? Tachometer. 50. Engine pressure ratio is determined by dividing turbine outlet total pressure by engine inlet total pressure.